What's happening everybody, 3G Geek here, and today I stopped by Best Buy randomly and I found this uh, Crash Bandicoot Crash Crate. And so uh, today we are going to unbox it and I am curious to find out what exactly is in this Crash Crate. It says on a little sticker right there that it is worth about 40 bucks. So we're going to find out if it actually is worth 40 bucks. Uh, so let's take a quick peek inside. All right, now let's pull out the first item. And um, I have no idea what this is supposed to be. Is this like a pin? Oh, so what this actually is is a bottle opener, a magnetic bottle opener. So that's pretty cool, actually. Um, I'll just lay that down right there. Let's see what else we got. All right, so we just got some gener generic stickers. That's pretty cool. Let's see what else we got. <laughs> so actually what these are, are um, coasters. So, so as you can see, you got the the uh, TNT, you've got the nitro box, and of course just the and the uh, bounce box as well. And let's see what else we got. <laughs> Alrighty, this, ladies and gentlemen, is a Crash Bandicoot mug. That's pretty cool. I like it. Well, as it turns out, that was actually everything in the box. So, uh, just to go over what was in there, there was the uh, mug, stickers, bottle opener, and coasters down here. So, originally, at the beginning of the, of the video, I posed the question, was this worth 40 bucks? Well, that was just actually the value it said it was priced at. What I actually paid for it was about 30 So, was this crash crate worth the 30 bucks that you would pay to get this? I would say it depends on how big of a Crash Bandicoot fan you are. All of these items that are in this crash crate are items that you can use on an almost daily basis. I mean, you have a mug, a bottle opener, coasters, and these stickers you can pretty much just place anywhere you want. So if you are an avid fan of Crash Bandicoot, this crate is perfect for you. If you are not the biggest fan of Crash Bandicoot, meh, I would pass on it personally. And so with that, um, I have fulfilled my want to find out what exactly is in this uh, crash crate. And with that, this is 3G Geek, signing off.